Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Diaphone, and Happy Kios just came out. Super fun character, and want to give some initial impressions and where I think this uh, character's headed and what kind of character I think he is. You know, the first thing that I like about him is he's just so fun. He has a lot of potential, and I think his uh, Musa is very diverse. And so he's kind of, to me, is like an anti-zoning slash rushdown character. He looks like he'd be zoning, but I think his pure zoning's not the best. He's not really good at like keeping people out. He's good at more of like making someone like Axel approach. And then once he's actually in, I think his rushdown is really good because of the H gun. But I think this character is just going to be like very difficult to master. I think top three hardest to learn in the game free. Not only does he have like a lot of inputs he has to do, like for example, you have your gunshot reloads and you have have your stance cancels you can cancel anything into his h basically whenever and you can create like many different frame traps um his supers are conventionally is literally two bars to use so you have to manage both the meters and i find it very easy to like lose track of uh one of the meters in the match but again that stuff will just take time with practice so i think this character you know he might seem initially weak at first because again everything just takes so much time to learn but honestly i think he's uh he might actually end up pretty strong but it's gonna take like at least a month to figure out uh what his optimal combo routes are i think he also might have like very polarized matchups so some matchups like axel he might be able to like force them to come to him and might have a good matchup where someone that can like bypass his clone and bypasses zoning very easily let's say someone like nagayuki his clone goes through uh happy chaos's clone it's actually pretty messed up i think that might be like a very hard matchup especially happy chaos having very poor health and having no reversal options <laughs> I can see him struggling against like some defensive characters for sure or very offensive characters um some of his tools like 214s i think is really good it's uh, when he pulls the gun out and then uh shoots i think it's very good counter zoning great damage uh and obviously the anything in the h gun is just really cracked out right i can go into block string and then i can just keep frame trapping with the h gun and it lets his conversions be really strong and then the pressure in the corner is just really crazy you can keep looping that you have six bullets <laughs> yeah you can just get wall break really easy with him and you can use the meter pretty well you know you have uh two different supers that fill up his different meters and obviously you have rcs and yeah i think i think the potential of this character is uh quite hot you know some of the things i didn't really like you know his role kind of seems a little lackluster it seems good for mix up but it seems like it's stroke without the hitbox <laughs> literally it has a little too much recovery in my opinion to be very useful like neutral for example um other than like calling out very specific moves and the clone takes a lot of health it's like seven percent health it's kind of crazy i so i want to show you a couple cool things i found on twitter uh shots to the spooter but here's some of that combo potential i was telling you guys about and keep in mind this is day one i don't know how op optimal this is but you see like you can get corner to corner full screen conversion i don't think anyone else has that and of course you know the character can also side swap lots of cool stuff one of the things i think people aren't talking about is the fact that he gets like a full combo off his 2p because again you can cancel 2p into h and then link into whatever you want so here's an example of using 2p to get oki I think this is really smart and then you could do some like nasty stuff like this obviously not very optimal but the fact that he has such a good what i call a bari or being able to mash out of stuff might help negate the fact that he doesn't have a good reversal because he gets so much off of a defensive jab uh, again another cool combo uh, this is just showing side swaps <laughs> i think stuff like this where you're using the uh, 236s to pop him up yeah using 236s to pop him up like that i think that's probably the more optimal routes just to conserve your resources. Yeah, so this is an example of what I think her optimal, or Happy Chaos's optimal combos will look like. Um, 2K2D, cancel into the 236S. And you see, you only use you're actually bullet neutral after this combo right and so again the the combo routes are gonna have to be fully fleshed out but like i could see the potential and getting to consider resources but yeah that's all i think this character is gonna be pretty sick i'm gonna keep learning this character um hope you guys uh like the character as well let me know what you guys think in the comments below and as always um if you appreciate the content you made this far consider like sharing and subscribing it really helps out the channel and i really want to make a uh, guide for happy chaos so i'm committing to it now i'm gonna say i'm making a guide for happy chaos um, might just be a little bit because again this character has so much potential so much to learn so anyways thank you guys for watching have a great day